We're talking performance optimizations, folks. This is like adding rocket fuel to your sports car. Vroom, vroom. Ladies and gentlemen, tech enthusiasts of all ages, hold on to your motherboards because, well, we've got some electrifying news straight from the heart of Silicon Valley. Or maybe just Silicon, not necessarily Valley. First up, we have the AMD 9000 X 3D chips are closer and closer and the rumors just keep pouring in with the updates as the whole situation progresses. Yes, the X3D, because well, AMD just loves cranking everything up to the third dimension. This beast promises unparalleled gaming performance and multi-threading power that will make even the most demanding applications cry uncle, or at least this is what happens if you take AMD's words for it, as the rumors suggest something totally different. But this of course means getting things ready for some much needed software updates to get things ready beforehand. Speaking of hands, it seems that AMD just doesn't want to drop the ball and won't give Intel a moment's peace since it's full on engaged into releasing its AMD Ryzen AI 300 series chip. Getting things going, get around for today we embark on a journey through the magical realm of firmware updates. Yes, I know, it sounds as thrilling as watching paint dry, but trust me, this one's a real game changer. Enter the AMD 9000 series, the latest superstar in the CPU universe where just when you thought that your new Zen 5 chip hype couldn't get any better, well AMD decided to drop the new Agessa 1.2.0.0a firmware update like a surprise new encore at a rock concert. Gigabyte, the brave knight of motherboards manufacturers has already begun to roll out this shiny new update making sure your Ryzen 9000 series is ready to flex its muscles to the max as soon as you unbox it. We're talking performance optimizations folks, this is like adding rocket fuel to your sports car. Vroom vroom. But what exactly does this update do? Well in true mysterious fashion, specifics are of course under wraps tighter than the top secret recipe. What's gonna happen? <laughs> What's wrong with you people? You don't know what real danger looks like anymore. <laughs> we know it's all about performance and stability, but how? Think of it as a secret sauce. We don't know the ingredients, but oh boy, we can taste the difference. Even though Gigabyte is out in front, don't count out MSI, ASRock, and Asus just yet. They're gearing up their own updates. Asus, bless their hearts, is still trying to play catch up, but we believe in you Asus, come on let's go, you can do it. So gear up, update your BIOS and get ready to unleash the full power of your Ryzen 9000 as soon as you drop it in. When AMD and their firmware division team up, it's like a blockbuster duo you never knew you needed. So stay tuned, stay optimized and as always feel free to subscribe, comment, share to this video where the rumors just keep on giving. But wait, there's even more, and buckle up because I know you are excited and ready now to drop the new shiny 9000 series in your motherboards and go off to the races, but we can still all wonder what's going to happen in the far over horizon when of course the exciting new X3D chips is going to launch. Well, first of all, let's address the elephant in the room. For years now, AMD X3D CPUs were like the calm, sensible sibling who never stayed out past curfew. No manual overclocking allowed without training wheels on, of course, or at least a headgear or a headpiece. Well guys, now it's time for a change. Rumor of course has it that the new Ryzen 9000 X3D series will finally let you put those clock speeds to the max and even beyond. But even though this sounds stellar, there is one problem with all of it. It's now being rumored that they will be using the exact same 3D V cache as with the 7000 series before it. So contrary to the early reports, AMD seems not to change its cache capacity and thus it will come up with something early similar as per the 7000 series. And of course, uh, this will kind of consist in the three SKUs that you can find right here. Thus, the combined cache of L2 and L3 levels will again top out at 144 megabytes. And since AMD didn't bother to change the sizes of the L2 cache, well, it means that they will be identical in comparisons with the 7000 X3D models beforehand. So, all in all, Per the latest rumors, coming back to the amount of 3D vCache, the AMD Ryzen 9950 X3D will feature a total of 128 megabytes of L3 cache with a single 3D vCache boosted Zen 5 CCD, uh, which will feature a 64 megabyte stack and another 64 megabytes from the core itself. The Ryzen 9 9900X, uh, will feature 12 cores, will also feature a similar configuration, but it will come with a lower overall cache amount due to its L2 being 12 megabytes and L1 being only 768 kilobytes. 
versus the 16 megabytes L2 and a one megabyte L1 on the 9950X. Thus far, it seems that the only change aside from the micro architecture for the new X3D models uh, would only be access to the overclocking features. Imagine telling your Ryzen 5800X3D it could only run at stock speeds, but why? It would cry because, well, of the heat, you would say. But with the new Zen 5 Ryzen 9000X3D, AMD has apparently figured out a way to manage those thermal concerns, allowing us to overclock to our heart's content. The Ryzen 9000X3D chips isn't all about just raw power. Thanks to the improved 3D cache, these CPUs are set to deliver significant performance boost in gaming and productivity. It's like giving your rig a turbo boost and an OS injection at the same time. And it is not just for overclocking, we're talking about full manual overclocks, folks. That means, of course, that you can tweak voltages, fiddle around with frequencies, and basically play mad scientist with your CPU. Just remember, with great power comes great responsibility, or at least in terms of CPU, a really good cooling solution. So what does this exactly mean for your average gamer or creator? Well, picture this, you're rendering a 4K video or dominating in a battle royale, and your CPU isn't even breaking a sweat. That's the promise of the Ryzen 9000 X3D series. High performance, without the heat, and let's not forget, this is a major win against our friends over at Intel. With AMD's advancements, the competition just got a whole lot tougher. Intel's Arrow Lake CPUs better watch their backs because, well, Team Red is on the attack. Previously, AMD played it safe with overclocking due to the risk of users turning their CPUs into expensive paperweights, but now they reportedly allow unrestricted overclocking, which of course you can adjust the core multiplier and voltage to get the clock speeds of a non-X3D CPU with the massive gaming performance of an X3D chip. Think of it as having your cake and, uh, well, you can eat it too but this time the cake is made of raw power. These new chips are expected to launch somewhere as early as September with the standard 9000 series CPUs dropping by the end of this month, which is July. If they're gonna be better than the 7000 series, I guess it's still up for debate, but one thing is for sure, the competition better watch out. And now the next new contender is of course the AMD Ryzen AI 300 series CPUs. These processors are the Swiss army knives of old tech world. They're built on the Zen 5 architecture with 4 nanometer technology. They come packed with 12 cores, RDNA 3.5 graphics, and some 50% more on-chip memory. It's like having a supercomputer in your backpack. And I'm saying backpack because this is mostly going to be integrated, of course, in laptops. These processors aren't just about raw power, though. With integrated AI capabilities, they make your PC smarter than your average bear. It's like imagine running an AI assistant like Copilot Plus to streamline tasks, overhaul virtual meetings, and even help with the content creation uh, side of things. Efficiency, you said? Well, these CPUs sip power slower than a slot drinking a smoothie. With up to 2x power efficiency in selected AI workloads, you can stay unplugged for longer and enjoy uninterrupted work and play. So, whenever you're building a new rig, upgrading your current setup, or just dreaming of a PC that you can do it all with, AMD has definitely got you covered. With the Ryzen 9000, Ryzen AI 300 series, and a soon to be released Ryzen 9000 X3D chips, your tech dreams are about to come true due to Teams Red. Guys, before I forget, I just want to quickly mention that I don't just cover news topics here on the channel, I also review stuff or fix stuff, and if you want to see my latest video where I take a stab and fix my broken AIO, you can definitely do so right here. Check out that video or feel free to subscribe, leave your comments down in the box below, tell me what you think about the new Ryzen releases, and let's start the conversation from there. Also be awesome if you want and subscribe to the channel, that would be highly and greatly appreciated. Thank you guys for choosing to watch today's episode. For more, you can check out the video right here. Stay awesome and see you guys in the next one. Peace out.